Hey guys, today I'm going to talk about a new citrus that I've added to my garden. It's not this, this is my Meyer lemon, and over here I got my bear's lime, and my blood orange. It's something a little more out there. It's this Buddha's hand. I'll throw up a picture of what this thing looks like. It basically literally looks like a hand. I only learned about these recently, so when an opportunity came up to pick one up, I was like, absolutely, this will be a really fun addition to the citrus in my garden. Um, they are mostly an ornamental plant, from what I understand. Um, mostly not used for eating. Um, Apparently you can use them for zest and you can cut them up and like use them for tea or candy them is another option. But if you were to cut these open, they are a citrus that literally is all rind basically. There's little to no juice or pulp inside. Um, and they are very alien looking because they, they're a hand <laughs> or a little octopus looking thing. And um, from what I understand, they, they grow uh, bunched up and then as they mature, the hand opens up. And I believe there are different varieties that will have different um, shaped hands, I suppose. And uh, from doing a little bit of research, because I was not familiar with these, they are apparently used um, for praying in other cultures. So that's why they're more of an ornamental plant. Um, and apparently you want to get ones that um, haven't opened up yet. They haven't become the hand. Um, because when it's closed, it apparently symbolizes um, the praying Buddha, and that's that's better for praying. So while I'm, I would say, very ignorant of the cultural um, importance of these fruits um, in other countries, I am very interested um, in it as a citrus um, just because it's such a wild looking fruit um, it's a distant relative of uh, lemons obviously so I'm really looking forward to when these start growing in probably sometime later this year it um, when I was researching it, it they said like fall through winter so I've seems like I've kind of missed the season on these um, but some of them uh, can grow sporadically throughout the year so I might get lucky, lucky and um, have some coming in but when I do have them growing I will post uh, an update and show off these crazy looking citruses. <laughs>